don't overcompensate for uh, someone else's um, negative um, negative um, feelings towards you to where now you're trying to overcompensate or you're trying to over um, like there was there was there was a message where um, someone okay someone gave you something okay but because you are ups you were upset about because the person was upset about how the person treated them now they were like okay well you gave me this but I want extra now because because of yeah you did good by doing this but I, I need to get an extra of what you of, of what you gave me you got to give me extra because because of all the heartache you put me through or because of all all of the things that you did towards me you know it's like somebody apologizing to you and then you're like okay well I accept your apology so if you accept your apology then you're not asking them you don't need them for, to do anything else for you but in this message the person was like okay well I accept your apology but now you gotta do this you gotta do this you gotta do this and you gotta do that and you gotta do this and you gotta do that and it's like don't overcompensate your feel your your hurt um to now say that you forgive somebody but now you are making them run run through loops to to oh, to compensate for how they made you feel and it's like no when you forgive somebody you just forgive them you're not looking for them to do anything for you you just got to move forward with yourself and say no i forgive them but they know not what they do you know so don't now take the pie and say no i need i need three pies now I, I need three cookies and a pie and a cake and a you know what i mean like they're giving you a cake and saying forgive me but now you're like no i, I forgive you but i need the cake and eat it too <laughs> i need the cake with the strawberries with the whipped cream with the <laughs> with the nuts and the sundae on the side <laughs> you know what i mean so god doesn't want us to live like that he wants us to forgive because when, when he forgave us, we were wicked and evil. He, well, you know, when when he came and sent his son, he, he sent his son. He sent his only begotten son, not not his third son, his fifth son. He sent his only begotten son, okay? He didn't, he didn't say, you know what, I'm going to send my cousin, <laughs> my cousin who I don't even speak to and I don't even know and I don't really care about. He said, I'm sending my only begotten son to, for, to forgive you for your sins. So he sent his precious jewel. He, he, he sent his diamonds to forgive you and your wickedness when you were against him. Okay? So do the same. Sacrifice as God did for you and forgive that person for they know not what they do. In Jesus' name.